Dr. Lawrence Maiden has had a remarkable career. A pioneering marine biologist, skilled photographer, and compassionate leader, Larry has revolutionized oceanography with a quiet dignity and generosity of spirit that have earned him the respect and friendship of his colleagues. Growing up in Northern California, Larry was naturally drawn to the ocean. He spent his college years at Berkeley studying biology, and when he wasn't DJing at the local classical radio station, Larry was in the lab, fascinated by a form of ocean life that almost no one else was studying at the time, marine jellies. These translucent animals of the sea were to become the primary focus of Larry's long scientific career. In graduate school at UC Davis, digging for samples knee-deep in a mud flat, Larry was temporarily distracted from jellyfish and zooplankton by a new interest, his soon-to-be wife, Kate. In his academic life, Larry studied under the trailblazing biologist, Dr. William Hamner. Together with Hamner's other graduate students, they were among the first researchers to use blue water scuba diving and marine submersibles to study ocean plankton, techniques that are widely used by marine biologists today. Their groundbreaking work led to a new, tethered method of scuba diving for scientific research and to the discovery of many new species of gelatinous marine life and to a career for Larry. In 1974, Larry and Kate left California to move east to Cape Cod, where Larry took a position at the Woods Hole Oceanographic Institution, starting out as a postdoc working for the late Dr. George Richard Harbison Larry quickly climbed the ranks from assistant to associate and then senior scientist. Marine jellies, in particular salps and tinafores, continued to spark his curiosity, resulting in a new understanding and appreciation of the behavior and physiology of these extraordinary animals. Those who know Larry well have described him as a meticulous scientist with the soul of an artist. He has brilliantly combined his dedication to scientific research with his passion for photography. By developing new lighting techniques, Larry has been able to capture spectacular images of elusive jellyfish, siphonophores, and other gelatinous creatures. His photography has earned him international recognition and has been featured in books, magazines, posters, and even on postage stamps. Larry's career at Huey has taken him all over the world. He has sailed on research vessels including the Atlantis II and the Oceanus and the Nor, diving as deep as his scuba gear could take him, and even deeper in Alban and other submersibles. He has led numerous international programs and helped establish multinational labs in Panama and Saudi Arabia. His impact as a marine biologist has truly been felt worldwide. Larry has served Huey as a teacher, mentor, and leader, most recently as the deputy director and vice president for research. Larry's leadership has been rooted in his experience as a scientist. He is committed to international collaboration and to spreading Huey's impact in ocean exploration and research across the globe. Larry's keen intellect and skills as a communicator make him a sought-after speaker and a superb ambassador for Huey and for all of ocean science. As a manager and a colleague, Larry's door is always open. He listens, he appreciates input, and he has devoted countless hours to ensure that everyone at Huey has the opportunities and resources they need to succeed. Alongside his achievements as a scientist and a photographer, Larry's legacy at Huey will be that of a compassionate leader who devoted every day to making Huey the best place it can be and for bringing out the best in all of us. Thank you for everything, Larry. You will be missed.